Hi guys, it's Gigi. Welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be an extremely personal video and one that I never expected to make on my YouTube channel. That is 100% safe to say. Although I have been letting you guys in on a lot of my personal life via vlogging, just, you know, taking the camera out and filming stuff, where I am, what I'm doing, who I'm with. I haven't really gone into detail and done a lot of explaining as a lot of you guys have been asking me to do. And that's just because I wasn't ready to talk about my sexuality and you know the changes that I've been going through and I finally am and I'm ready to have like a real sit down conversation with you guys because I know it's a little bit unfair having been so personal and you know open on my YouTube channel and then kind of just leaving you guys hanging a little bit which is the last thing that I want to do I love you guys more than you could ever know and everything that I've been reading online that's positive and accepting and you know just just I literally just got goosebumps the comments that are filled with so much love and support really do mean the world to me and you guys don't know how much it helps me every single day this year from even the beginning has been one of the most amazing exciting inspiring and just best years of my life I've been doing a lot of reflecting and examining on who I am and who I've become and the changes that I've gone through mentally and I fell in love with somebody and that person happens to be female and like I said at the beginning of this video I never thought that I would be making this video because I always thought that I would be with a man but after everything I've gone through, the two other coming out videos that I've made, one in high school as a gay man and one as a transgender female, I thought I was done. I thought that, you know, that was it. I really did. It's been killing me inside every single day and I'm so happy I'm finally sitting down and talking to you guys and letting you guys know that from this point forward, I am a lesbian. And I want to let anyone out there questioning their sexuality or what's normal or how they should feel or should act, that it's okay to feel this way. I said, why am I feeling this way towards a girl? What, what, what What's going on, you know? I've, I've lived this, this long and I thought that I knew who I was attracted to but then someone may come along in your life that you're like, oh my God, ding, this is the person. And that's okay, accept that. And I haven't been shy about showing her on my YouTube channel because I'm not embarrassed. I feel extremely proud of the person that I have fallen in love with and I feel so lucky. You know, I've been in several relationships with men. I've experienced a relationship, you know, companionship, all of that stuff with men, but I've never experienced this feeling until I met this girl and that's how I know that I'm a lesbian and to be completely honest and transparent which is what this video is all about it took me a while to be completely comfortable with saying I am a lesbian I had never really been around many lesbians I hadn't really had many lesbian friends and that's just the god honest truth and while we're on the label of lesbian I just wanted to say a little side note, Ricky Dillon actually made an amazing video and I believe the title was My Sexuality and he kind of went into his thoughts on being back and forth with straight and gay and you know kind of went in on the term of being asexual and all of that and I found that so inspiring and Ricky if you're watching this I love you so much and you are so brave and you are one of the people that inspired me to make today's video. Society has labels that people like to throw on other people that they don't know or they don't you know understand or haven't experienced yet and I think that that's something a lot of people were doing to me initially being like oh my god are you a lesbian now and I was like I don't know if I'm a lesbian now maybe I'm bisexual or you know pansexual or whatever like all of these other labels and I think it's truly disgusting that people feel the need to push other people into categories or labels of sexuality who the fuck are you to tell me what I am and what if I'm none of the above what if I'm just everything what if I'm nothing it's your life and that's the beauty of it you get to live it however you want to live it but today's video is about me personally because that's the only thing that I can speak to and now I feel confident saying that yes I am a lesbian and the best part about that is no one can tell me otherwise because it's my sexual identity just like it's your sexual identity don't let anyone bully you or tell you that you are something that you don't feel you are and take a stand for who you are you know I've noticed over the course of the 24 years I've been on earth oh I feel so old I've noticed that life happens and people change and just like I've said in previous videos it's not the fact of why people have changed it's not 
who is making them change. It's nothing like that. It's just the solid fact that people change. And that's what's so lovely about life. You know, each day is a new day and you can experience and discover things about yourself that you didn't know before and be happier than ever. I think that if you watch my YouTube channel recently, I know when I watch footage back, I'm like, oh my God, girl, I cannot get that smile off my face. And shout out to everybody commenting hella nice things to me because it really does mean the world to me. And of course, there are a lot of people saying negative things and I'm sure a lot of you guys that are in school right now or, you know, just doing a lot of soul searching figuring out who you are as a person are experiencing a lot of ignorance and it's not easy and I want to let you know I go through the same things that you go through. I literally found out that I was a lesbian this year in my life so there is no rush and I think a lot of people get hung up on you know what am I gonna be at the end of the day or like what's the end goal or they just want to finish the race but I don't think that there's anything more beautiful than the journey. The people surrounding you, the spontaneous things that might happen, you know, bumps in the road, although they are super negative. And I am the worst person to say this because I have the worst patience on earth. I need everything done right now, but in the grand scheme of things, it's so beautiful. I would not have seen falling in love with a girl coming from a mile away. But now that I'm here, and now that I'm, you know, telling everyone and officially letting everybody know, I feel so happy. And I hope you guys appreciate me being honest because making this video was super intimidating. A few months ago, thinking about doing this, I was like, oh my God, no way, no way. But I'm at a place now where I can say proudly, I am a lesbian. And shout out to all my fellow lesbians, girl, hey. <laughs> and that's another thing, dude. Guys fucking suck. I mean, the relationship that I'm in now in comparison, it's just like, you can't even compare the two. I just feel so much more myself. It's just crazy that it took me this long. And people fucking suck. So when you find someone that you literally connect with, don't push them away because of their gender or, you know, who they are or what they do or you know, anything. If you find someone that you connect with, do you know how rare that is? There are billions and billions of people in this world. And it's a really lucky thing to find someone that you connect with. Romantically, emotionally, mentally. Why not just take that and go with it? And I know it is really, really nerve-wracking when you first like someone or, you know, you're getting into a relationship, but there really is no better reward than falling in love. And I really hope that every single one of you out there gets to find that because there is no better feeling than being truly loved and accepted for who you are. And before I get all emotional and sappy, I just want to let you guys know I love you so, so, so much. And I'm really happy to get the fact that I'm now a lesbian out there and, you know, officially out there so just everybody knows. And I really can't wait to see what you guys say in the comments. And until I see you guys next time, stay gorgeous.